Rana attacked 70 people in Argentina on Wednesday, even biting off one girl's fingers. Small freshwater fish with big teeth that feed into popular nightmares. There's something in the water! <laughs> Fodder for Hollywood flicks like Piranha 3D. And piranha attacks are happening all over America, depending on how you define piranha attacks. You know, a bite here and there. For example, if you want to eat fish, the price has doubled since 1990. Wheat prices just jumped by 4.9%. Chocolate was up 28% for the first 10 months of 2013 and climbing. And it's not just food. That other staple, energy cost, is also skyrocketing. People are paying just for the privilege of getting connected to the surveillance grid with smart meters. For example, in Chicago, the average household electric bill will increase by $5.5 per month just to pay for new smart grid infrastructure. But because of Obama's war on coal, by summer, energy rates are expected to soar by 23%, and not just in Chicago. Remember when Obama said companies could build new coal-powered plants, but it would bankrupt them? Well, he's shutting down coal-powered plants, and it's bankrupting you. But hey, prices are going down because of natural gas, right? Nope. Expect a 36% increase there. And then there's the cost of Obamacare. If the other surcharges are coming at you like a school of piranha taking hundreds of bites out of you, Obamacare is coming at you like a great white shark. 2% on your insurance policy, 3.5% on the insurer, 2.3% on medical devices. Altogether, $479 billion in new taxes. And besides the new taxes on insurance policies, insurers, and medical devices, there's new taxes on investment income, Medicare, biofuels, drugs, retirement benefits, tanning salons, hospitals, even capping deductions on special needs kids. That's right, a tax on special needs kids. Now, if $479 billion doesn't really register with you, because we talk about billions and trillions all the time, let's put that into perspective. Out of all 187 nations worldwide, 162 nations don't even have a gross national product as high as the Obamacare tax increases. Countries like Denmark, Austria, Finland, Greece, Ireland, Israel, Taiwan don't even have a GMP of $479 billion, the amount of money that Obama is going to steal from Americans for his affordable health care. Which brings us back to Argentina the country where 70 people were just attacked by piranha. They only have a gross national product of $474 billion, less than the increase in taxes for Obamacare. The government does take a bite, doesn't it? The facts are in. The studies are legion. Sodium fluoride and other toxic members of the fluoride family are devastating the health and cognitive ability of the American people. So why are the social engineers adding it to the water? Simple, dumb down the host population that the parasitic technocracy is feeding on. We may not have been able to get fluoride out of the water supply yet, but we can help to get it out of our bodies. I am extremely excited to announce the exclusive InfoWars Life Fluoride Shield formulation, fusing six of the best documented ingredients from around the world to help the body remove not just toxic fluoride residues from the body, but a whole host of toxic substances. Let's take a stand against the globalist by blocking their poisons with Fluoride Shield. I use Fluoride Shield every day. Secure your Fluoride Shield and other pioneering formulations at InfoWarsLife.com today. Let's start cleansing our bodies now and support the InfoWar at the same time. That's InfoWarsLife.com.